What's going on guys, Logs here, and this is the new Call of Duty Vanguard official Stalingrad gameplay demo. But these demos, they're pretty much just showcasing the campaign and the graphics and how the guns are gonna feel and how it looks and stuff. That's all they're showing, it's no multiplayer gameplay and we can see some mechanics in campaign, but we just can't know if it's gonna come to multiplayer or not. But going into this, we're gonna take everything with a grain of salt. We don't know if things in campaign will transfer to multiplayer, Warzone, yada, yada, yada. So let's just react to it. It is in 4K. It looks like she just got pretty much artillery striked, bombarded, everything's in disarray. I don't know if this will be this very start of the game, like the opening scene or not. Um, or this is just a demo that they made. I don't know, but graphically is awesome. Okay. So the Germans are pretty much just, I think, escorting people out. It looks like they just bombed everything. And she's a female, I mean. That crouched to move quickly. Hmm. Graphically, this thing, this game looks awesome. All right, looks like he's like looting or something. Kind of, kind of reminds me of The Last of Us, to be honest, but... Nice. So, I see the PlayStation Square icon. This might be recorded on PS5, which looks amazing. We've got the, uh, the shotgun. The five-shot shotgun. Ooh. Ooh. Now that is sick. I like that. Destructibility, dude. She being able to go through like different parts of the uh, the map and campaign and stuff is gonna be fun. I don't know how much that will transfer to multiplayer. Again, we don't know anything about multiplayer at this point. Dude, this game looks beautiful. Oh, that's a guy that's a He's shooting at the Germans. That might be her father? I don't know, she keeps saying Papa. This game looks, this game looks intense. They, I haven't been excited for a campaign in any recent history. And I'm actually going to play this campaign. Dude, this is gonna be sick. I haven't played a COD campaign since, like, I don't know, Black Ops 2, maybe? Oh, yeah, get the Mosin to Gaunt. 7.6254R, I believe, is the, uh, the round. So, I did see screenshots of this scene. Basically, just people pointing out the scope and how weird the scope looks. That does look weird. But, ooh. Oh, this looks freaking sick. Damn. She's a badass, man. What are we talking about? Oh, yeah. You know they're pushing. Free push. Doors open. Push door. He's down. He's he's, he's cracked. He's, he's cracked. He's ass. Oh, sh do you see that? She got a hit marker through the wall. That's nice. Okay. The mountain with the car. Ooh. I love the... The sound of the car. The sound's just so sick. Oh, this looks so freaking fun, dude. Oh. Oh. This is gonna be so fun. Like, I'm not even excited for multiplayer right now. Like, just the campaign looks good. Dude, she's got like a... The six on! <laughs> the six on screen! Let's go! I thought that tank was just gonna turn and blow her up, like just end it. Man. You would think that the soldiers would see her and just be like, what the hell? <laughs> So like I said before, this is just campaign. If 
I'm not gonna get all butt hurt from watching this gameplay saying, oh, they added this, they added that, or look at the sniper scope. You just can't go into that with mindset. Like, you don't know if any of this will be in multiplayer. We don't know if the, uh, whatever it's called, blind fire or whatever, is in multiplayer. I see a bunch of people complain about that. We don't even know if that's gonna be, like, a legit thing that's gonna be broken or whatnot. Like, we just don't know. You can't be upset about everything, man. Enjoy the gameplay. Because it looks beautiful, this game. Especially if this is on console, this game looks good. Visually stunning. I'm sure my RTX 3080 graphics card will love this game. Ooh, 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 ooh. I'm, I'm gonna have to turn up the FOV though. This FOV's killing me. <laughs> The Moldov. This looks looks so much like uh, World War II, Call of Duty World War II, which came out in two, 2017. It's weird the gas. The gas kind of came out of nowhere. Ooh. One hour earlier. What? You're telling me in one hour it went from just pure middle of the day to like pitch black? Okay, so the Russians have the four, have like everything fortified. My guess is that everything gets bombed and she just starts going John Wick on people, just destroying. Uh, but this game just visually looks amazing. I don't know why she's like a stealth character, but I guess because she's a woman, they didn't really let her fight. Um, so she kind of has to sneakily just, you know, train on her own maybe. I don't know. I'm just freaking free balling at this point. It's a 10 minute video, guys. What do you want me to talk about for the 10 minutes? That last guy had a car 98 in his hand from the looks of it, which is weird. These are Russians. This might be a captured car 98. Oh! Oh, they do have female soldiers. I don't know if that was a thing in Russia in 1943. <laughs> oh, that's fucked. I mean, it's 2021, you gotta make a game that's, you know, includes everyone. It doesn't have to be factually accurate. It just has to, you know, appease the masses. I like how the bombing is pretty much just change it from daytime to nighttime. Wow, she did all that walking for nothing. She's already back at where she started. <laughs> Let's go. I like how she just, like, slide canceled that plane, just ducked it out of the way. Moose agrees. Moose is actually really looking forward to the game. Like, he already told me this game's gonna be amazing. We'll have to wait and see. Oh my goodness. Oh, R.I.P. That was about to be a squad wipe. Whoa, 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 whoa. The whole building's collapsing. Also, who... Who bricked this house? This, who bricked this building? That's a terrible... Those bricks are terribly out of place. This is an incredible scene. Oh my gosh. This is like the Fast and Furious movies. It's so crazy. I like it. I like it. 
November 5th, dude. It can't come any faster. Well, guys, that was it. That was the gameplay demo for the campaign for Call of Duty Vanguard. I'm very excited for the game. Uh, so many people are hyping it up and trashing it at the same time. There's so many different people talking about the game. For me, you can't have an opinion about the game until you can actually get your hands on it and play it. Sure, you can go off of what you see in gameplay demos like this, but if you're gonna say that, oh, the snipers are gonna suck in multiplayer just from watching a campaign trailer, campaign demo, it's just... Well, you're already putting yourself in a bad mood. You're already setting it in your mind that the game's going to be terrible. I'm going into this game with an open mind. I hope it's going to be good. I have high hopes for it. But uh, if it's trash, it's trash. You know, I didn't really like Cold War that much. But I went into it with an open mind. I thought it would be good. Just didn't turn out that way. So hopefully that's not the case with Vanguard. Super excited for it. Can't wait to play it. Let me know in the comments what you guys think. And I will see you guys later. Deuces.